This video is for you if you are looking to grow in your current role and are also planning to look out for opportunities in the next couple of years. Consider this to be your five-year career growth plan. In this training, I'm not only going to guide you step by step of how you can get a promotion in your current role, but I'm also going to guide you how to build your personal brand and share networking strategies that will help you get your next big job once you're ready to quit. Pause this video right now and get yourself a notepad and pen in order to draft a career plan with me. Have you ever drafted a written career plan before this? Drop a yes or a no in the comment section below. Your comments are valuable to this community. Before diving in, please subscribe and hit that notification bell to be informed whenever such awesome videos are published from this channel. Give this video a like if you're excited to know more about your career development plan. Hi, I'm Madhurima, India's first 10x corporate readiness transformer. I have trained over 10,000 professionals like you and helped them skyrocket their career growth. Let us first discuss the steps to grow in your current role and then later in this video we will go ahead and discuss networking strategies which will help you land your next big job when you are ready to quit. Step 1. Understanding your North Star It doesn't matter if you have 2, 5 or 10 years of experience, you must understand your key result areas or KRAs very well. Key result area is a set of goals that you would have already got from your manager. Ensure that you understand all of them. Also, look at your KRAs to find which is the most important one. Let us call this your North Star, which is the guiding light to your organization's or department's success. For example, for salespeople, it could be the number of units sold or revenue generated in sales. For project managers, it could be time or money saved. For customer service professionals, it would be the CSAT score aka the customer feedback score. Now, if you are serious about your career and need some guidance to write your resume with respect to the header, profile summary, skill section, work experience, etc., then I have some good news for you. I share all of this in the Breakthrough Resume course, which is linked in the description box below. This is a one-hour training which you can take at your preferred time and pace. Grab this course from the description box to revamp your resume today. Step 2. Come up with action steps to overcome challenges. Now, once you have a good understanding of your North Star, sit and write down what are the challenges that you have to face in order to overachieve it. Do you need to know more about the product or your process? Do you need to undergo some training or do you need to resolve some conflicts going on within the team? Or do you need to communicate better? Pause this video here and write down on your notebook three action steps that you are ready to take in order to overcome the challenges so that you are able to overachieve your North Star. Step 3. Document your progress. Once you have started taking action, document the result month on month in order to monitor your progress. It may take like a quarter to see visible results like increase in CSAT, revenue, profits, or decrease in errors, time, and cost. Step four, meet your manager. Once you have made some significant progress, meet your manager and show them in numbers the progress that you made month on month. I usually advise my clients to prepare a PowerPoint presentation for that extra appeal. Step five, ask your manager for that promotion and salary hike. Tell your manager that you have contributed actively in order to achieve the company's North Star and you are looking to go to the next level. Also, have the same conversation with your manager's manager because he or she is the key decision maker in your promotion. Also, if you want to know what exactly you should tell your manager in order to pitch that promotion or salary high conversation, then I already have made two excellent videos on them. I would leave a link of those videos in the description box below and also at the end of this video. I hope that you are making notes. Make good use of that notepad and pen today. Build your personal brand at work. Here are eight steps to do it. Ensure that you dress well to work. Wear professional attire that makes you look strong and confident and also aligns with your organization's culture. Always proofread your emails and reports. Check for errors, typo mistakes or how you can enhance them further. Ensure that you are seen and heard at work. Make your presence felt. Give an idea during a meeting. 
Offer to conduct training sessions or workshops on your area of expertise. Look for opportunities to collaborate on a different project that is more challenging. Volunteer for additional responsibilities that align with your skills and interests. Take an initiative to propose and implement process improvements. Network with key decision makers like taking a break with them, having a casual conversation, or even going to team outings. Request constructive feedback from superiors and colleagues. Act on this feedback to display professional and personal commitment. Showcase positive attitude. Maintain a positive and enthusiastic demeanor at work. Be supportive and helpful to your colleagues. Now, let us come to the networking strategies that will help you get the next big job once you're ready to quit. Start networking with people outside of your organization, even if you're not looking to quit your current job. This will allow you to not be desperate, be patient and build relationships with people who can refer you to their company in future. How can this be done? It can be done through LinkedIn. Reach out to professionals and connect with them who are from the same field. Understand their skills and experience. Go through their profile. But first, ensure that your LinkedIn profile is up to date. Have a professional picture and a strong LinkedIn headline so that people accept your connection requests. Let us take this to the next level. Ask your connections to come on a video call with you where you share your experience with each other. By proactively networking and building relationships with people who are outside of your company, you will already have a pool of professionals who would be ready to refer you to their company whenever you are ready to quit your current job. These people would already be familiar with your skills and expertise. Employee referrals are a powerful way to get noticed during your job application process. Having an established network increases your chance to secure those referrals when the time is right. Update your resume every 90 days even when you are not looking for a job. This is an advice I give to my clients because it ensures that you are up to date with your skills and accomplishments. When you get an unexpected opportunity which is wonderful, you do not have to sit down and write your resume from scratch. Networking is not just a job hunting process. It allows you to build genuine and professional relationships. Leveraging platforms like LinkedIn allows you to strategically increase your network and getting onto video calls takes this to a personal level. Take up courses on personal development and training. Learning will not only allow you to brush your skills up, but also help you stay updated according to the current industry trends. The enhanced competencies that you gain will not only help you in your current job, but will also prepare you for future opportunities. If you are serious about your career, you are 100% committed to grow, you need some guidance to write your resume, then I share all of this in the Breakthrough Resume course, which is linked in the description box below. Go ahead and grab it. This is a recorded training that you can take at your preferred time and pace. So far in this training, we have established step by step of how you can ask your boss for a promotion, how you can build your own personal brand at work, and also some wonderful networking strategies that will help you with employee referrals once you're ready to leave your company and take up the next opportunity. Apply these learnings for massive career growth. Please subscribe and hit that notification bell to be informed whenever such awesome videos are published from this channel. Share this video with a friend who would benefit from it. I wish you all the best for your career journey and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.